Hey, what's going on? This is Alex with DJ Cut Entertainment. Today we're going to go over our client portal, accepting a proposal, signing the contract, payment options, how to log in, and all our planning forms. Usually after we have either an in-person meeting, uh, a video chat, or a phone call, I'll create a proposal for you guys over all the details that we discussed about your particular wedding. And they're gonna be noted uh, inside the program called Check Cherry. So I'm gonna go through the process of how you get a login, what's all in these forms, and kind of the beginning to end steps to make sure that your event is very successful. And this uh, program will take away a lot of the questions that you might have about your event. So let's dig in and I'll show you exactly what we got going on. So here I made a temporary account of what you should expect uh, in your email. So here is a link to the proposal. This here is a way to our make a payment gateway. Uh, most people either usually do PayPal or Venmo. If you see here, we have a link to our pricing sheets. So all our prices are on our website, but I like to be very transparent and I set my prices for the whole entire year. So you can always refer back to this form if you guys need to add something to your package or your guys' wedding. So what we have here is uh, a Dropbox link and this is our uh, DJ prices for wedding. And this includes uh, wedding DJ services. We have our videography packages. We have our photo booth packages lighting and any additional services um, that you guys want to check out. So that way you can always refer back to this of like, hey, uh, we decided we want to add some up lights. Uh, we need to add a cocktail setup. You guys can always refer back to this. If you're one of my clients that are getting videography, here's a little bit more uh, detailed information on our videography packages and then the different services uh, that we offer. Just informative information for you guys to help with the planning process. So once we've had our initial phone call or meeting, you're gonna get this link. And what this is, is gonna be a detailed list proposal for your guys' wedding. What we have here is the date of your event, the location, your package detail, whether it's a DJ package, DJ and photo booth, DJ and videography, all the details are gonna be here. Then we have any additional add-ons, whether it be lighting, extra speakers, sound, anything like that is gonna be listed in these forms. And then also at the bottom, it's gonna be the price for it. Um, and then any deposit or retainer fees are gonna be added in here so you guys can see everything. And you can always go back to this form here and see what our prices are. So if you go down here and you go accept proposal, and so what that does is it brings you to this next screen where it has your email and then you can sign here electronically. If we have to update our terms and services, let's say you add another package, then you have to re-sign it. But it's really easy to do. We'll just resend you a link and then you go in there and just type in your name and it'll record where you signed it from and then we can refer back to them. Now this contract will always be in your invoice. So when we go to the forms and we look at the invoice tab, the very bottom of that will have a copy of the terms of service. And then here you can sign with your signature. But before you do that, I want you to take a look at the terms of service. Um, this one here is just for a DJ package, but if you have um, a photo booth with it, or if you have videography, it's gonna be tailored to what package that you guys have. And if we have to update it, if we uh, agree on something different, then we can update it. But every time that we update it, we'll have to have you guys re-sign it. So let's go back here. We're gonna close that and we're gonna sign this. And collect, I have accepted. So now we're gonna create a password. Save the password. So here you can see your event has the date, the package details, venue, and if we have any media, nothing's in here right now, but you guys can add media if you want us to see pictures, um, if you wanna upload some songs, if there's custom songs, it's all in there. Um, it will show you your starting balance, uh, payments collected, uh, your balance now. If you guys send in a payment, then we'll go in there and then we'll manually put in manually put in the payment for you guys. 
So once we've created a proposal for you guys, you guys have accepted the proposal. Uh, you've sent in a, a retainer and the contract signed. That will lock down your event. And then what we'll do is we'll send a email to you where you'll have a login. And you can either click the link on there and it'll take you directly to login or you can go on the website and I'm gonna show you how to do that. So up at the top corner, we have the login. This is where you'll enter your email. If this is your first time, then you'll pick a password. Over here is where you can reset your password if you forgot it. In the next video, we'll go over all the planning tools. Thank you guys for watching this video. If you guys have any other questions, feel free to reach out to us at info at Thank you guys very much.